Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. We're heading back to the Kakarai Forest now. What do you have to say, Navi? I wonder what's going on in the forest right now. I'm worried about Surya too. Hmm. Nothing good from what we've heard. Creepy around here. Whoa, what the... Hell of a reception committee. Big Deku Baba. These guys are just like regular Deku Babas, but... They're a little tougher. They can survive a lot more. But we've filled up on Deku Nuts now, so that's... That's something. Mad Scrubs. What the heck's with all these monsters in the Kakarai Forest? It's nowhere like this when we were a kid. Even at night, if you go back there, there's no monsters in the Kakarai Forest. Hmm. Why is that fairy following you around? You're not one of us. No, I'm not. I see. You didn't have any problems entering the forest, mister. Did the meanies out there bother you much? Before the great Deku Tree died, you wouldn't see things like that around here. Since it's dangerous outside, I always stay inside my house, but I'm bored to death in here. Wait a minute, that's Mido's house. What are you doing in his house? Alright. Now, folks, eh, great, you're still... Eh, retreat, will you? Flee from my sword, will you? Of course I will. Wow, this cliff looked a lot bigger when we were a kid. Alrighty, let's keep going. We're gonna enter the Lost Woods now. Why? Well, Saria said that the Forest Spirits were calling her. And, uh, remember where Saria said the Forest Spirits were? Right in the Sacred Forest Meadow, so that's where we're going. Well, problem is, this time around, uh, if you don't remember the way, you can get lost pretty easily, because... What the... What are you? Though you wear cockerish clothing, you can't fool me. I promise, Saria, I would never let anybody go through here. Well, that's too bad, because we know Saria. You're gonna have to play Saria's song to get through here. That... melody? So Saria plays that song all the time. You... You know, Saria? That song. Saria taught that song only to her friends. Okay, I trust you. When I see you, I, I don't know why, but I remember him. That was probably my younger version of myself, but that brings up the question. It's been seven years and everybody else has grown up. Milan grew up, so why have these kids? It's going to be a bit of a pain in the ass uh, navigating the forest at this point, because, uh, well... The music doesn't work like last time. You have to remember what it was like. So I'm just going to use the old stand at the edge of the hole and try and see through trick. All right, now let wait, wait a second. Okay, so we head this way. I just made a th I, I just went in a complete circle. All righty. No wonder they call this the Lost Woods. Every freaking clearing looks the same. Alrighty, do 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 Okay, here's where we're supposed to go. And then we take a right, I do believe. And then we're here. Sacred Forest Meadow, hot diggity. Hold on. My stone of agony is tingling. Let's blow up a hole let's blow a hole in this meadow. Alrighty, so what's down here? Disco! Freaking wolves. Wolfos are a pain in the neck. Well, they're actually pretty weak, but uh, they've got quite a bit of health if you don't whack their tails. Fortunately, if you L target them, they'll be considerate, and uh, only one of them will focus on you. Wait for it. Down you go! Cool! All right then. What's the box, George? Boop. Purple rupee. Well, that's something, I guess. Let's get the heck out of here. I thought I saw something in the distance when I jumped up. From here on, we'll be going through some narrow passages. If you take it slow, maybe you could sneak up on some enemies. Use L targeting to always look at the proper direction. Set your view so that you can see down the next corridor before you turn a corner. 
Once your view is set, hold down L to sidestep around the corner. That way, you won't be surprised by an enemy waiting in ambush. What sort of an enemies? Last time all we had were the... Ouch! Frickin' frickin' fire! Quick and bing! Boom! Beasties! Those are moblins, folks. And we're gonna need the hookshot to take them out. Fortunately, they're really dumb, so... All we need to do is wait for him to turn up his back. And then... Tag him in the butt. Now, these moblins are patrolling the corridors pretty carefully, so... Just keep moving. It's not really that hard to outsmart them. They have, like, zero peripheral vision. Okay, wait for it. Wait for it. Wait. Got him. Alrighty, so... I can never remember if there's... Nope, not there. Problem is, if you sidestep, in my experience, you tend to sidestep right out in front of a monster, so... I'm gonna wait for it. Hold it... And... I wonder if I can sneak up and slash him in the butt- OH GOD, THAT LOOKED PAINFUL! Bye-bye. Not sure what that clicking sound is, but... I don't think I could stun him. No, I can't stun him. That went right to his arm! What the hell? Alright, new rule. Only stab moblins in the butt. Let's... Ah, crud. Water. Wait a minute, am I... Okay, so I head around this way, and... Stabbed in the butt. Hmm, you look familiar. Gotcha. And now you look like you're burning up. I've got a medication for that. It's called ice cream. And yes, we're on the other side. Cool. Alrighty, so. Now this guy's a pain in the neck. Do not L target him or his aim will become uncannily good. And don't hit him with Deku Nuts either. Your job is to wait for him and dodge that big club. And then dodge his feet and then whack him around from behind. It'll never occur to him to turn around. Moblins aren't very bright. And one more. Down you go, Timber. So, now what do we do? Well, we head up the stairs. And up the top of the stairs, we find... Surya? Oh, dear. She's not here. So now what do we do? Well, that doesn't sound safe. You look familiar. Hmm. And the theme starts up again. The flow of time is always cruel. Its speed seems different for each person, but no one can change it. A thing that doesn't change with time is a memory of younger days. In order to come back here again, play the Minuet of Forest. Listen to her, by the way. The Minuet of Forest uh, is a warp song. It allows you to warp back to where you came from. Thing is, with most of the songs in this game, it's a repeated series of three or four notes. The Minuet of Forest is an exception to this rule, so it's not so easy to remember. It's sort of a waltz, or a, a minuet. You have learned the Minuet of Forest. Adorize you. I'll see you again. Are you gonna pull an Impa? Huh? Yep. Where'd you go? Let's get the heck out of here. Alright, to get into the Forest Temple, we're gonna have to get a little closer. The staircase is broken, so we have to snag that tree limb and head in. Anyways, uh, not sure when I'll get back to this, but we'll be in the Forest Temple next time. See you then.